During the program, Honorable Regional Minister for Western Region, Honorable Hobby Otre Dakon, was also there. And then Ideal TV went to have an interaction with him. And then he explained that he is so excited of the whole program, the performance by the artists, the talent that Western region they have. And then he encouraged them that they should move with them. They should go forward. And they shouldn't only stay with music. They shouldn't only depend on music for survival or to make their future better. But rather, they should do other stuff so they can have more palatable future as they are expecting to have. And he also said that as the regional minister, there are a lot of things that he has put in place. And then he was going to ensure that all these things that he has decided that he's about to put in place would help. And then next year, God willing, we'll have a massive RTC award that would Chale, it would blow our minds, you get it, uh -huh. than the earlier ones that we have, including this year's. Uh, so um, let's go and uh, listen to him. Okay, I'm Nana Mind, you are. I'm Kobe, Dark Minister. <laughs> the Western Regional Minister, the youngest regional minister in the Western region. I'm um, honorable. Um, how do you see it's a program posted in the Western region by. Um, other stakeholders, by some stakeholders in the region. Um, as a regional minister, looking at these great performances by this young, talented youth, what do you have to say? Um, I believe that if you look at the talent yeah. and the number of music that is produced in the West Room, it goes to show how talented we are as a nation. I'm really just one industry, and it's just a subset of what they are showing. Clearly, it shows that we have enough talent in the region to catapult us all the way internationally. Um, I've been in this business before. I've been a producer. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, Sasquatch. Oh, okay. Yes, uh, so we understand this. I also used to be a nightclub manager for hey. a nightclub for, for, for four time. years. Oh, okay. Even when I was at the university, I used to come over the weekends uh -huh. to run the show. Oh. So I understand this business, yes, and like uh, one of the rappers said, he said that they shouldn't plan their lives only around music, yeah. they should also plan their lives around other things. Yeah. So as they generate income in this area, they can invest them into other, other uh, businesses yeah. and sustain life. You understand? You know, show business is a very, has a very s small lifespan mm -hmm. for a lot of the artists. I mean, the Papa Yansens, the AB print, they have their style, yeah. so it's taking them for a very long time. But for the other categories, it's not like that. Yeah. So it's very important they also plan their lives and make sure they are successful. Okay, so going for what advice you have for this young, talented uh, artist coming up? Oh, I think that when Kenata was in my office, yeah. I told him one thing. The money you are making, invest some. Invest them in other things. And it's the same to this young man who he said today. He works at Talo, okay. and I was there two years ago to launch his uh, production. And it's the same advice. Um, all that we are saying is that turn the music into something else. Okay. Okay. Music is fine. It's good. And I believe that, like Sarkozy said some time ago, didn't spend all your money. Spend it on blocks, buy blocks, and build houses. You know that kind of thing. So I believe that this is a very good show. We need to encourage them to do it better and bigger next time. I mean, I'm looking at it that next year we'll plan well with them as a regional administration. So we can use that to invite more people into our town, to use our hotels, spend time in our markets, at our golf courses. So it becomes a whole, a, a whole weekend. People can come and enjoy it entirely. And like I said, we want to make the Western region the number one tourist destination in Ghana. We've had our plans, we are fleshing it out. And very soon we'll be launching our tourism plan for, for the Western wow. region. Yes. All right, um, Honorable. Um, finally, finally, finally. Looking at the whole program and then the organizers and everyone. Uh, even in the oh, yes. Um, those days when I was a young man, I used to bring Skyhawks in town. Okay. I used to bring KKD, Azik is that junior. Um, and do other programs with G-Man and the rest. So I, 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 I see what they've done to be very creative. 
Um, like I said, we want to see it bigger and then uh, improve as we go along. I mean, next year our mindset will totally be different from what we see this year. And I also think that a lot of the artists that come on stage, they should learn to play popular music so it makes them more popular. Before you even introduce a new song, you should play a popular music, catch the crowd so they can go along with you. Then you can put in your new slot that people don't know about. I believe it makes it more fun and then people will remember and come back uh, uh, next year. But I think it's a good program. It's a very, very good program. Is this your first time witnessing LTC? Yes. In fact, I, I, I've seen it on YouTube, but it's the first time I'll be here present myself. Okay. And maybe this time I came as a regular minister. <laughs> as well as the MP. Yes, as well as the MP for Tadi. Yeah, for Tadi. <laughs> I don't know, but thanks for speaking to Aide. Thank you too.